Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we will talk about the easiest method of installing WordPress inside machine tours. So without further ado, let's get started. As you can see here, I have already opened WordPress.org, the place to go and download WordPress. But the method that today we will be talking about, you even do not need to download WordPress from WordPress.org. This one click solution or one step solution will do everything for us. So the solution that today I'm talking about is known as local WP or sometimes known as WordPress by Flywheel. They also host your WordPress website online. But here we are talking about hosting WordPress platform in our local device. And this is absolutely free. You just need to visit this website which is localwp.com anyway i'm also going to provide all these links in the description of this video from there also you can directly open this page and then simply click on download for free now here you need to choose your platform here i am using mac os that is powered by m series chip so uh, we need to select this mac apple silicon and most of us need to select the same as Apple now have stopped making its computer powered by Intel chip. So if you have any M series processor, simply select Mac Apple Silicon. Now fill up these details and click on get it now. So as you hit get it now, you will see the download process will start. And if it does not start automatically, you can always click on this link which will eventually force the installation. So here we can see by clicking here, we have downloaded the same setup multiple times. Now let's open anyone. And now here, what we need to do is we simply need to drag this local to application. After we successfully drag this local to application, all we need to do is we need to click on launch pad and then we need to search for this local. Just click on that and in this way guys we will start this application for first time and you will be greeted with the following screen or maybe you will be asked to log in to local so you can actually log in using your google account now um, let's click on create a new website and here you know you will get these two options choose the first one and let's say if you have already a backup of existing website you can also choose that zip to install the website so that is also possible in our case we're going to choose the first one and now let me click on continue here you can give your website a name let me write here technoholic and let's hit continue now here if you see Generally, in case of a ZAMP method, we used to have Apache server, but here we have got this NGINX server, which I would say is better than Apache or Lightspeed in terms of performance. We can see that how easy this method is that you do not need to select or start anything manually and everything that is happening for you is best in class or you know the best that currently market offer that is happening behind us and for us the method of installation is pretty easy simply click on continue and now here you can create your id and password let me do that and here you can see we also have an option to create a wordpress multi-site that i would say is really awesome so it depends on us whether we want to create this wordpress multi-site or want to create a single one now we simply need to click on add site and now we just need to wait for a while and it will also ask us to provide password so simply provide your system password here and now you will see the installation of wordpress has begun and there we go we can see it is installed which was very fast guys and um i would like to show you the version here we have of wordpress so the latest version as of today is 6.4.2 
and here also we can see the version is same 6.4.2 which is great i would say now let's say you want to see your wordpress installation folder simply click on here go to site folder and you will able to access the folder now let me close this similarly if you want to open site cell you can do that in just one click not only that local wp offers offer several type of customization for example let's say you want to choose um, apache as your web server you can do that you are also getting ssl certificate which is awesome guys i mean generally we do not see ssl certificate in local host and here you can also select the php version that you want to go with therefore we can see we have all necessary customization available but in a very nice way now let's click here on open site and there we go here also we can see the way the url is presented is quite awesome guys when we compare this with a regular xam server method so from url to managing your wordpress website inside local wp it really look very clean and nice now let's say you want to you know access your admin panel you can simply type here slash and wp admin the wp also have provided the same link here as well and not only that we also can see there is one option which says one click admin if you turn this thing on the local will itself log you in inside your wordpress dashboard isn't it cool guys in this way guys you can make your necessary customization prepare your website and create your masterpiece i hope guys you find this video helpful and informational if yes then do like and subscribe to the channel for more such content and i will catch you soon with another such tutorial till then you take care and bye bye